this is an island. At least, I think it's an island. There's a reef out there and perhaps saw any grown-ups. A plane ride gone terribly wrong. Stranded on an island in the middle of nowhere. Its only inhabitants, young boys. There are no parents, no rules, and no mercy. One must fight to survive. Four boys push their way to the top. Ralph, the unlikely appointed chief. Trying to balance his ego and the needs of the boys, he must play the adult figure on the island. Some of his ideas have gotten the boys in trouble before. Is it a one-time thing, or was Ralph the wrong choice? There's another thing. We can help them to find us. If a ship comes near the island, they may not notice us. So we must make smoke on top of the mountain. We must make a fire. Jack, the bloodthirsty leader of the hunters. His current obsession, killing a pig. He lives and breathes the hunt, waiting for his opportunity to strike. Will he be successful, or will Jack's bloodlust turn him from pig hunter ah! to people hunter? We want meat, but we don't have any. Yet. And we want shelters. Besides, your hunters came back hours ago. They've been swimming. I let them go. I went on. I thought I might. I thought I might kill. But you didn't. I thought I might. But you haven't yet. Simon, the strong but silent leader, who is the most independent and morally conscious, he struggles to fit in. With a heightened understanding of his surroundings, his sharp mind and keen intellect may be what saves them all. Have you been awake at night? They talk and scream, the little ones, even some of the others. As if... As if it wasn't a good island. As if the beastie, the beastie or the snake thing was real. Remember? And Piggy, with the most intelligence and sense of reason, he struggles to be heard and to recreate civilization on the island. His awkward personality and appearance lead the other boys to separate him from the rest of the group. Piggy tries to act like an adult while still dealing with childlike emotions. I expect we'll want their names and make a list. We really ought to have a meeting. I don't care what they call me as long as they don't call me what they used to call me at school. And what was that? Piggy. Piggy. They called you Piggy. <laughs> Piggy. Ralph, please! They will experience more freedom, savagery, and fear than they ever imagined. Uh, almost too heavy. Uh, not for the two of us. Uh. We've got to have more rules and obey them. After all, we're not savages, we're the English. And the English are best at everything, so we've got to do the right things. Nobody knows where we are. Perhaps they knew where we were going to, but they don't need more, because we never got there. The best thing we can do is get ourselves rescued. Rescued, of course. But I would like to catch a pig first. If you're hunting, you sometimes get yourself feeling, well, there's nothing in it, of course. Go on. Just a feeling, but sometimes you feel like you're being hunted. Like there's something behind you in the jungle. You can steal upon one, paint off faces, surround it, and then... I was talking about smoke. Don't you want to be rescued? All you talk about is pig, pig, pig! The little ones, they're hopeless. And the, the older ones aren't much better. You see? All day I've been working with Simon, and they're off playing or eating or sleeping. Your chief, you tell them. There ain't nothing we can do. We ought to be more careful. I'm scared. You're always scared, fatty. Kids, you're all acting like a crowd of kids! Will Piggy be heard noticed? Or will he live in the bottom ranks of the boys? I got the conch! Just you listen! The first thing we ought to remember is shelters down there by the beach. It wasn't half cold down there at night, but the first time Ralph says fire, you all goes howling and screaming up this here mountain like a pack of kids! How can you expect to be rescued if you don't put first things first and proper? We've got to work together. We've got to fend for ourselves! Will Jack's savage personality get out of control? Does Simon's intellect play a key role? Or will he remain an outcast? Will Ralph hold his own, or will he drift to the darker side? 
No one knows. Find out in Lord of the Flies. All right, that's a wrap.